power folks i don't know if you can hear me well but we are here at the new sm me and forest g and the ladies and so we're going to give you a tour of uh what is this sm central is this sm central or sm downtown okay so this is sm this is sm central You got the grocery store over here to the right. And to the left, you got the Jolly B. Let me just give you a panoramic view here. There's the Jolly B. And there's the Kentucky Fried Chicken. And there's where you can rent the little carts for the babies, but we got the stroller, so we're not in the market for that right now. Yes, yeah, so I'm trying out this stroller cam. I don't know how well it's going to pick up the audio. And it looks like it's a little bouncy because it's not a it's not a 100% solid uh, clamp. So this audio or this uh, video may be unusable. Hopefully the GoPro stabilization is straightened out. This is the first time we've been here to the uh, first time we've been here to the uh, this new SM. But the old SM is just not a good place for walking around. It's too small. No place to push a stroller. So we're certainly glad that this new SM opened up here. And there's a place called Mesa. I'm assuming that's a Mexican restaurant. There's a Japanese barbecue and a Shakey's Pizza. And 4G is kicking his feet, so he's probably uh, causing a bunch of pops on the audio. Got this uh, unique load shop here to the right oh upstairs I'm seeing a prime steakhouse of course G stop kicking son and over to our left is a uh, is a Starbucks Yeah, folks, so I want to thank you for joining us. I'm not sure how uh, interesting this video is going to be. But if you're one of, if you need to take a look at the new SM, you're looking at it via our stroller cam. But I think, I think between uh, his kicking and the shaking coming off of the stroller it may not be as, uh, High speed as I thought it was going to be. <clears throat> the bench store on my right. Upstairs, got a Jerry's restaurant. Penny shop. Oh, we got a BDO with some uh, ATM machines, which uh, I need to hit so I can pay my rent. And look at this and they're not crowded they're not crowded they're brand new they hopefully work so we will come over here and see if we can't get a tune let's see if we can get a tune out of this trombone for us Jake highly recommend the ATM machine here by this BDO of course everything in this mall is brand new son you got to sit down this dude keeps trying to jump out like when I slow down he thinks it's time to jump out so I got to keep his speed but I highly recommend the uh, ATM machine at that BDO brand new easy to get a tune out of that trombone probably the, the newest ATM machine in the Philippines oh by the way there wasn't 30 people standing in line like you experience when you're in Bacalor at the beat day they got a merry-go-round right next to this bread talk. 
picture taken with Santa, I don't know. But it's it's right here next to the bread talk. It says exit to uh Marikit Park. Line starts here. Okay on the back side we got a uh China Bank. Right next to China Bank is uh Macau Imperial Tea. And there's a Max's restaurant. Wow, and it's not crowded. My goodness, folks. This could potentially be the only SM in the Philippines that's not overcrowded. And so there you go. I'm not sure what's up with that. But there you go. Macau Imperial Tea. And you got a China Bank. Now I said uh, on a couple videos before, my car does not work at China Bank, and it may be, may be that uh, it say plus on there. I don't know. I've never been able to get a tune out of a China Bank trombone, and if you have or you know the deal with it, leave it info down in the comments below. But I've never been able to get a tune out of a China Bank trombone. This place is brand new. They've even got a screen over here to uh whoa force G. Hey, hey you know. turn around man, hold on. Hold on to that buddy. Okay, there's just Starbucks. And you know, rolling around with the stroller folks, it's a uh, challenge at times to find uh elevator that works or one that doesn't take two hours of standing in line to get up the escalator so what we do is just somebody carries carries the baby up the uh, escalator I'll push the stroller okay so somebody grab force G and we're gonna go up the escalator yeah. if anybody says anything it's too late I'm already running up the uh, up the escalator but there there's a shaky's pizza right next to this escalator and i think uh I might be looking at i can't see that other little restaurant next to shaky's but there we go look at the beautiful fatima the beautiful atefe and they're both got a good grip on force g that dude likes to jump. He likes to jump, crawl, climb. You gotta watch him. Oh, and we got a Chow King up here. And there's a Tokyo Tokyo. I'm not sure what this spot is. It's called Black Spook Black. Scoop Cafe. And it says life begins after coffee. So it looks like a little little trendy little coffee shop. And for G, hold on man. Let me just give everybody okay. So this is the back side of it right here. Well, what a cool little that's a cool little trendy coffee shop. But we'll keep going over here to try to give you guys the uh, more complete tour via the stroller cam. I'm just curious to see if this is going to work out. Prime Steakhouse, unlimited imported steak. All right, right here in the middle. Maybe Force G's trying to jump out of here. I don't know what's going on with this dude. Hey man, you can't jump out of the stroller, man. It's a stroller cam. We got a uh, Belgian waffle spot. Alright, so 
Faye's got to carry fourth G because he's just making too many escape attempts. And I guess it's pretty much my fault. I got this GoPro mounted on this little uh, clamp. So he looks up and sees the GoPro and he wants to turn around and get up there. And obviously it looks like a nice toy. So a little bit of my fault. And if you're looking for a restroom, that's right there to the right. located on the food court on level four so it looks like level four has got the uh level four has got the food court so we're taking a look at all these restaurants but i think we'll probably be able to find something a little more interesting up at the uh, up at the food court all right so we're swinging right okay got a sports central over here with some adidas and nike gear Got a nice uh, Watson's Pharmacy, which uh, is not crowded. Folks, I'm really loving this place. It's wide open, so if you have kids and a stroller, plenty of place for the, you to push a stroller around. It's new, it's clean, and there ain't a million folks here like most of the SMs in this country. So I am certainly loving this spot. We, we really needed this uh, new SM here in Long Island. Okay, we've got a national bookstore. I'll swing down here to the corner. I'll swing down here to the corner and then uh, it'll be time to head on up to the third level, my friends. Got a couple of uh, optical spots in here. If you lose your glasses, you need a new prescription. So I have some optometrists. But let me swing this corner down here. Hello. Let's see what's on the, on the corner. Okay, now that's the parking garage. Folks, that's another awesome thing about this place. They actually have a parking garage. So many places you go to in this country, there's no damn parking garage. There's nowhere to park. It's a huge problem. But it looks like there was some planning that went into this spot. And we do have a parking garage. How can you beat that? Okay, you ready to go up? Go up right here. the uh, escalator now folks don't don't try this with your baby in there make sure somebody grabs a baby holds on to them there's your public service message don't use the stroller on the escalator when the baby's in the stroller sometimes security yaks me about it but there ain't no baby in here and I'm not waiting on the elevator okay you got a skin station another level of the parking garage Now this looks like the counter here. I'll check the parking rates. It's uh, 30 pesos, big straight car and motorcycle. And, um, 200 pesos for uh, if you lose a ticket. So it's 30, 30 pesos for uh, parking, big straight car and motorcycle. It's a nice home. All right, folks. So uh, shout out to my buddy from Australia. Hadn't seen him in a few months. And, uh, he's back but if you're looking for a good diesel generator this this generator right here 
Uh, it's a long story, but we we bought one of those before. Pretty good little heavy duty uh, diesel generator. But folks, this is the SM Appliance Store, and I just looked at TVs at Savers up there in Barrio Barreto. And after I finish my walking tour, after I finish my walking tour, oh, go ahead, go ahead. I'm going to go in here and I'm going to research the prices of the TVs at the SM versus uh, Savers. You got it, boy? Yeah. All right, is he good? You going to stay in there now? All right, folks, hopefully, of course, G stays in there for the rest of his ride. But let me just let me just give you a look around. This this looks like a very uh, well stocked, good selection. The appliance center here has got everything from Sony, LG. So we got to come back in here and check the TVs, uh, check the prices against what I just looked at at Savers up there in uh, Barrio Barreto. Got one of these little mini uh one of these little shops right here the ladies like to go in here and buy little gifts and stuff they got all kind of little knickknacks look at this dude hold on son stop all that kicking Dog. He got glasses on that dog. The dude had the dog in a baby carrier with glass, sunglasses on it. All right, folks, if I have Maria here, I would take her over here to this uh, little bouncer over there. Uh, of course, she's just not big enough to get in there. Yeah, we'll take Maria there. Right over to my left is a uh, is a Dickie store. We got a sale, fifty percent off. Buy one, take one. I mean, it's pretty much the same around the world. But if you put uh, any type of percent off or buy one, take one, my old lady is baited, hooked, and swearing up and down. It's a great deal. It don't matter what the deal is. If it says promotion or buy one, take one, she's gonna swear that you got to buy three of them There's unica uh bio and another entrance to another entrance to the sm the sm store and folks you know this audio may be absolutely horrible a lot of times if it's borderline I still post a video and you just have to deal with it if it's absolutely atrocious and unusable then I won't but what I'm thinking is there's gonna be a bunch of background noise the uh, audio on this GoPro is actually pretty darn good for an action cam now when me and the old lady went uh, mountain climbing the other day the GoPro for two clips did uh, start glitching and sort of let me down screwed up uh, two clips were just uh, sort of like hanging and freezing and the the uh, stabilization went to shit for two clips and then it went, went right back online but when it was doing it it didn't do it well at least I couldn't tell on the screen it was you just discover it when you download the files and you got two bad files okay kb boy or uh, bye boy whatever unlimited barbecue so it looks like a korean korean barbecue place cronuts juice avenue okay let me spin my let me spin my stroller cam over there it's uh bay boy whatever it is unlimited korean barbecue so this third level there's a couple of uh 
old lady's complaining of being hungry already. I know she's hungry. And I'll tell you what we'll do, because this is kind of the end of the road. We're gonna come this way first. I'm gonna just show you the cinemas and then we'll go down to the uh, food court and then try to find these ladies, uh, try to find these ladies something to eat. I'll make a swoop over here by the cinema. And folks, historically, me and the old lady haven't really been that big into uh, going to the movies. But now that we got a brand new cinema and a brand new SM, and oh, by the way, it's an easy tricycle ride over here in the Lamborghini, we may actually start coming over here to the movies. Have a nice romantic evening with uh, wife number one. Take this girl to see a movie. And, you know, throw some uh, popcorn and coke down the throat. All right, let's see what's shown. Okay, but I'll just give you a panoramic view right here. Tickets are over there. I'll give you the price of the tickets here in a second, but let me show you what's shown. Okay, there you go. Frozen 2. We got Unbreakable. Kai B Gun. I guess if I can show you over this way. Ooh, nice snack bar too. Everything from hamburgers to hot dogs to uh, popcorn. Okay, there's guests. Mañanita. Jumanji, the next level. And let me come over here. Well, I can see the prices. It's anywhere from Frozen's 220 pesos. Unbreakable's 210 pesos. Kaya Begun 190. Okay, folks, anywhere from 190 to 220. You're looking at uh folks around four dollars. Okay, just roughly four dollars for uh for a ticket. Four bucks to go to the movies. You gonna put them back in there? Okay, folks, get ready for the drums to return. I'm putting Force G back in here, so now the drums on my audio are going to return here. But I think we're almost to the end of this walking tour. Okay, so there's the cinemas. You got a Buco Juice Place, Bone Chai. Yeah, but that's good to know about that uh, to-go travel place and that little uh, print shop, whatever it is back there. And if you got to send a FedEx pack, you can send it from that to-go spot. Okay, now just a panoramic, panoramic view. You got Samsung, Vivo, Oppo, Cherry Mobile. It looks like a little game center. Yeah, some game centers over here for the kids. I like to go in there. They like to look at the games and I'll win them a uh, stuffed animal. There's two. Sports Zone, Game Center, Tom's World. And over to my left is one of these all about baking shops. So if you're into baking, uh, which we actually have an oven, Right there, all about bacon. Got all kind of baking specialty stuff in it. That particular store. Little, little stuffed animal shop called Blue Magic. Place called Moto. So if you're looking for uh, if you're looking for a motorcycle helmet or anything like that, they got all kinds of stuff right here, folks. But on my on my right side is just nothing but wall-to-wall -wall, uh, games for kids. Okay, this is Greater Image, Glamour ID, 79 pesos. Now we can probably get our 
passport photos there. And to the left is another entrance to the SM store. Okay. These ladies want the uh, lechon from uh, Salo. I guess I'm saying that right. So they got everything from uh, 139, 129. So you're looking at about three dollar for uh, unless you go with that platter over there. But they want the lechon. They want the uh, the pork. There you go, right there in the lechon. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, induction cookers to keep everything. <laughs> what you want, baby? It's a um, I'm with this uh, chicken honey spot. I'm going to tell you what I'm going with. I'm going with one order of a Chinese pork roll, and then I'm going to go with the. Uh, oh, shit, I don't see it. Hold on, I gotta look at the menu. Let's see, 119 Chinese pork roll, and then I'm going with the a la carte debone chicken wings. I gotta try the honey Bavarian. It's got to happen. That's a Chinese pork roll? Or that's a sea that's a over there. I don't know what to say. This place is a high speed. They got the remote, just like, uh, huh. just like back in the. I don't even know if they use these things anymore, but I got, I got the remote, so when, the, when my, my food is ready, you're gonna page me. All right, so the lady's got this little lechon plate, and I don't think it's gonna be enough food, but there's the lechon. Yeah, that's not enough. We got peanut bit for uh, Forrest G. He loves to eat the peanut bit, which has got squash in it. So he'll tear that up. But yeah, I, I knew that wasn't gonna be enough food, so I got uh, some chicken wings on the way to let these ladies try. See if they like the chicken wings. Yeah, folks. So I'm digging this place. The restrooms are clean. Um, ain't no soap on the wall, but hey, yeah, yeah. ain't no soap in the Philippines in the CR. Definitely. But the restrooms are clean. This place is brand new. What else can you say about a brand new place? I mean, it's brand new and. Uh, Definitely needed a new SM. So we're happy about this. Between this and the Walter Mart, got everything in the world we need. You know, the local market every day, but on the weekends, uh, it is nice to step it out to uh, to the Walter Mart or now the SM. We'll start coming here more. This place is nice. The other one, there was just no place to uh, push a stroller. No place to really unwind. It was just too crowded. All right, so I'll show you the uh, I'll show you my food when it gets ready, but I'm just waiting, waiting on a remote to go off, my friends. This dude is sleeping. Hold him, baby. Look at this. All right, here's your holiday hours right here. 2019 holiday hours. Uh, 10 to 10. I don't know if you can see that. We're waiting on the. Waiting on the elevator. The baby's asleep now. She got this glass elevator. She's scared to death of the elevator, so she's she's gonna take the uh, escalator. That is kind of scary looking over there. If you open up that door, take a step. That's death unless that elevator's there. <laughs> Yeah, I'll meet you on the bottom. Alright. <laughs> 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 
Got the, she got the six Krispy Kreme donuts, my friend. You can enjoy them donuts, baby. Happy but you gotta, you gotta share them, okay? Great time here at the SM. Loving this place. We've got the Lamborghini waiting on us. Krispy Kreme donuts. It's a beautiful day, and folks, life is just good. Let me just show you around outside of this place. I can't really show you the whole thing, but uh, brand new. Here's the entrance. I'm not sure if, where the taxis line up. I don't know. But this is where our man picked us up. Right here. Alright, out of here. Great time with the SM. Man, so much nicer than the uh, the old SM. It's just the way it is. Much nicer place to go to. I recommend it. Keep me stop right here at the SM, obviously, no problem. I'll just give you a kind of a look around. A little ride through along the boat. What's that? Ulu ng Apo. Ulu, Ulu ng Apo? What's the Ulu ng Apo? Delicious. They're about to taste some Krispy Kremes, my friend. 